Hello friends, my name is Linda Corbett and I'm with Nye House Education Center. If you're not familiar with Nye House, our mission is literacy for all. Today we're going to explore one more of the five rules that apply to the English language. Today's rule is going to be called the dropping rule. Before we begin, let's review a few academic terms. Remember, a base word. A base word is a plain word with nothing added to it. A suffix is a letter or a group of letters added to the end of a base word. A derivative is a base word plus a suffix. So again, as we look at this example, we see the base word hope and we're adding suffix full. When we add the base word plus the suffix, that becomes the derivative, hopeful. Now let's look at the dropping rule. There are three columns here. The first column has base words. The second column has suffixes. The third column has derivatives. Remember that a derivative is a base word plus a suffix or prefix. Let's look and focus on the first column. Let's see how these base words are the same. What do you see in final position? Yes, you see that all the base words end in a final E. Let's look at the second column. Tell me about the suffixes. Are they vowel or are they consonant suffixes? Yes, they all begin with a vowel. So they are vowel suffixes. Tell me about the derivatives. How are they the same? Yes, the final E was dropped. If a base word ends in a final E and you're adding a vowel suffix, you will drop the E before adding the suffix. Here are the checkpoints for the dropping rule. The base word ends in a final silent E and we're adding a vowel suffix. If any checkpoint is missing, you will not drop the final E. The dropping rule applies to derivatives. Let's try some of these out. We have the base word shape and we're adding suffix ed. Does my base word end in a final silent e? Yes. Am I adding a suffix that begins with a vowel? Yes, that's a vowel suffix. So, will I drop the final e before spelling? Yes, you will drop the final E. Shaped is spelled S-H-A-P-E-D. Let's try another one. My base word is smoke and I'm adding suffix I-N-G. Does my base word end in a final silent E? Yes. Am I adding a vowel suffix? Yes. Will we drop the final E before spelling? Yes, smoking, S-M-O-K-I-N-G. Let's try one more. We're gonna take the word shape again and we're gonna add suffix less. Does my base word end in a final silent E? Yes, am I adding a vowel suffix? No, I'm adding a consonant suffix, so I will not drop the final E when spelling. Shapeless will be spelled S-H-A-P-E-L-E-S-S. -S -S. So that, my friends, is the dropping rule. If you'd like to watch any other YouTube videos, you can watch it on them on the Nye House YouTube website, or you can see them at www.nyehouse.org. If you would like any further information, you can contact us at 
I-N-F-O, info at nighthouse.org. I hope you enjoyed learning about the dropping rule.